Hello everyone, so welcome to the Cool Crochet Society and today I'm going to show you how to make a standing single crochet. So a standing single crochet means that you can join yarn onto your work and do it so there's no turning chain. So it's going to look straight away as a single crochet and it means that you join onto your work will be hidden. So I'm just going to join it onto this stitch up here so you can see how it's done. But first we've got to be able to put the hook on Sorry, put the yarn on the hook. I'm just going to zoom in a little bit so you can see. Right, so the way to do it is you're going to have to join a little bit, what might be a bit different to usual for you. So you're going to wrap the yarn around two fingers. So we'll tail end down here, wrap around, then you're going to wrap around again, but go over to the left side and down. Then bring your hook underneath the first thread, hook the second one, bring it under, and pull. And you will get this knot coming onto your hook. Okay. Now this is going to act as a loop. So that when you bring your hook through, you've now already got one loop on your hook and that is going to act as one of your stitch loops and it's going to really nicely set us up. So bring this in and you just go through the stitch as usual. Oops, did I get my yarn around? So hook a loop, bring it through as normal, put that tail to the back and then I'm just going to pull through both loops and there you go. That is your standing single crochet and that is the loop for your first stitch and it looks exactly like a single crochet and so it hides the beginning of that join. So it just gets rid of a beginning chain and instead gives you a stitch. So I'll just show you how I do that again, one more time. Okay, so tail end at the bottom, you're going to wrap around once, then you're going to wrap around twice, but make sure the second one wrap goes off to the left. Hook under the first wrap hook the second one through, let go and pull and there, and that is how you make the knot you need for your stitch then we just go through the stitch as usual as we would form any stitch, pull your yarn through just throw that tail to the back and pull through both loops and there is your standing single crochet. Simple as that and it's a really good technique to hide that beginning stitch. So I hope that's useful. If you need any help come over to the Facebook group the link is in the banner and in the description. I'm more than happy to help and I will see you next time for more crochet tips. Bye for now.